Pasta is always a winner dinner in my house, but sometimes it's nice to shake it up from its usual tomato sauce partner. So I'm going to show you how to make my simple pea pesto pasta, which I like to top with pan fried salmon. People are often a little bit nervous about cooking fish, but here's my foolproof way. Pat your salmon fillets dry with kitchen paper, or you could use a white fish if you preferred, um, and then season it with a little salt and pepper. Place a large pan on a medium to high heat and add a tablespoon of oil. Once nice and hot, add the salmon fillets skin side down and then leave them to cook for about six minutes. Now resist poking, prodding and moving them about to ensure a nice crispy skin. While they're cooking, add frozen peas to a small pan of boiling salted water and add dried pasta, I like to use wholemeal, to a large pan of boiling salted water and give it a good stir. And then cook both of those until tender. Now carefully flip over those salmon fillets Mmm, look at that crispy golden skin. And leave them to cook for another three minutes or so until they're cooked through. Once cooked, drain the peas, pop them into a food processor or blender, and add mascarpone, or you could use cream or cream cheese instead. Add finely grated parmesan, give a good squeeze of lemon juice, and a handful of yummy fresh mint leaves also. Season with a little salt and pepper and give everything a quick blitz. You want it to be a lovely rough puree. To be even speedier, you could even have this sauce made from the day before and then just warm it through gently in the pan. That salmon should be cooked now. So just remove it from the heat and the pasta too. Give it a good drain and tip it back into the pan. Then add that lovely pea pesto. It smells so fresh and tasty and give it a really good stir through. Spoon the pasta onto serving plates and sit a piece of salmon on top. Now, if the kids prefer it without the skin, then remove it and perhaps flake the fish over and scatter it on top. Scatter over some mint leaves and serve with a piece of lemon for squeezing. Now, wasn't that easy? And it looks so tasty and really healthy too. There's the richness from that salmon and then that freshness from the pea and mint. What a great way to hide the vegetables from fussy children too. Mmm, it's delicious.